G'day folks. This is a isolating switch I picked up the other day with the intention of using it on the big VFD cabinet when I eventually rework it for capacitor bank supply and uh, charging system all in one. This will be the main isolator mounted on the outside of the cabinet. Obviously with power going in. This was three phase but I can use it on single phase to break all of the uh, leads. I'm not sure what classification this switch is because it's uh, obviously IP66D. Uh, what is it? Class 2. What is it? DIVS 1 and 2 types A and B. Replace gaskets after service. Class 1 zone 1. Group 2B. Isolate circuit elsewhere before removing cover. Pretty serious shit. Like explosion proof or extreme weather proof. I'm guessing explosion proof maybe for gas or oil processing facilities or mines. Mechanically it feels alright. I'm going to take the cover off and just see what it's like inside. Pretty serious switch. And the cable has steel traces all the way around the outside. It's proper armoured three-phase cable. The cores are actually quite small considering so I'm saying it's explosion proof switch for a mining or refinery equipment. There's actually a gas and oil refinery just across the bay from me, so I'd say that's where it's come from. They've scrapped out an old piece of machinery and this was one of their isolating switches. Well that's all the switches. Not very big. What's it made by? Kima I mean not even Australian or German to that matter. Definitely an explosion proof switch though. This housing is pretty serious. I'd say it's from the old the gas refinery. That's really serious stuff. For a switch that small. Only a 32 amp contact. Yep, this is a good solid explosion proof switch. But it'll go well on the uh, control cabinet anyway. Definitely looks the part. It's on a bearing. There's a ball bearing race in there. Pretty good. Thanks for watching, folks.